Hey, how's it going guys? Mr. Boss for the win here, and in today's GTA 5 video, we're going to be talking about the thank you gift items from the Diamond Casino and Resort, and also the free rewards for the Diamond program starting to appear in Grand Theft Auto Online. So there has been a ton of confusion around these free gifts, items, and rewards that we were supposed to be getting, and I think some of this is actually Rockstar's fault. So let's actually start with the thank you gifts that you were supposed to receive. If you see this splash screen that says the Diamond Casino and Resort, $250,000 reward, and Diamond Casino and Resort memorabilia, it says thank you for making the grand opening of the Diamond Casino and Resort such a momentous event for GTA Online. As a show of appreciation, you've been awarded with $250,000 for playing GTA Online between July 23rd and August 3rd. And you can also claim the Ash Diamond Hoodie and the Diamond Casino and Resort Wall Art, both available on the house from the casino store until August 11th. So what's interesting about that splash screen is that August 11th has come and gone, and there are still a ton of players who haven't received these rewards. Now, I fortunately have, and I'll show you guys what that looks like right now. So before you actually log into online, if you did receive the money, you will get a in-game notification that looks like this. It says for being a dedicated GTA Online player, we are awarding you $250,000. So that is the message you should get if you received the 250K for Rockstar. Now, as far as the new casino items go, I have received both the hoodie and the wall art. So the wall art looks like this. It is the vintage Diamond Casino and Resort painting. Now it's a little bit tricky because you won't actually find this in the casino store. Like if you were to go downstairs and go to the casino store, you wouldn't find this. And what's also interesting is Rockstar have made this painting only available in certain spots. Like I had to go through like six different rooms before I could find a wall where this painting could actually be put up. So if you guys are wondering if you have it and you've checked the casino store, well, fear not because it actually isn't found there. And if you've been struggling to find certain walls in which it can go on, well, just keep trying because it sort of depends on the wall you're trying to put it on if it will actually show up. There's some walls and places in your penthouse where you just simply can't put it up, which is a bit strange. Now, as far as getting to the hoodie goes, you can actually find this in the casino store. If you go to hoodies, you will find the ash diamond hoodie right there which again it says los santos and has a diamond logo on the front overall it is a pretty cool hoodie and if we take a look at the back of the hoodie as well i actually kind of like it it says the diamond casino and resort it's kind of like this casual baggy yet still kind of luxurious hoodie design so overall it's really cool i have received all three of the items however a handful of you guys are claiming that you have not in fact I would say more than a handful. Remember that these gifts were supposed to be deposited by August 11th. That means that the last possible moment, the final day in which you should have gotten this was yesterday, at least when I'm recording this video, which is Monday, August 12th. So if you are one of the handful of people that have not received the, either the $250,000 or some sort of combination of the painting and the Ash Diamond hoodie, my really only recommendation is that you submit a support ticket with Rockstar support. Now, I wouldn't expect a response instantly because from what I've seen so far, a lot of people are either not getting the money, not getting the painting, or not getting the hoodie. And again, we're already past the day in which all of this should have been delivered by. It's August 12th right now. That stuff was supposed to be delivered by August 11th. So I can see why a lot of people are getting frustrated by this because they're expecting these gifts, they met all their requirements, and they are not receiving them. So going through Rockstar support is going to be your best bet. I know that might be a little bit frustrating because you've either had a bad experience with them or you just know that they might give you some generic response, but you want to let them know because they might be able to like manually give you the items. And if you deserve them, that's clearly what you want. So now that we've gotten the thank you gifts out of the way, let's move on to the diamond program rewards. So the diamond program rewards were supposed to be handed out between August 8th and August 13th. And I've looked around on Reddit, on the GTA forum site, on Twitter. I've even asked in my own Discord if anyone has received the rewards from the diamond program. 
And everyone I've talked to has said no, that they have not received any of the rewards. Now, again, if you're curious what those rewards are, they're wall arts, t-shirts, tattoos, watches, and vehicle liveries, all for the brand new supercars and sports cars that were added in the update. And so I wanted to see if I had even unlocked any of those. So I started taking the vehicles that were supposed to get those brand new liveries to the Los Santos Custom Shop and something weird was happening. When I would bring them into the LSC, it said that I had a new livery available, but when I actually clicked on the livery, I didn't have any new options. So I don't know if something glitchy is going on with the Diamond program. Again, the rewards were supposed to be rolling out August 8th, and the final day we were supposed to be getting them is the 13th, which is tomorrow. So I guess Rockstar is going to be saving all of these rewards to roll out on the 13th, or it might be another situation where it's ultimately being delayed. Now, I think Rockstar is going to have a little bit of a problem with this because in one of their recent Newswire posts, they have confirmed that there is going to be a second batch of Diamond Program rewards. How is that going to work if they can't even give out the rewards for the first set, which we currently don't even have in the game right now? So hopefully, again, that clears up a lot of the confusion that has come with the Diamond Program rewards. And don't worry, no one has gotten them, at least that I know of so far. I don't have them in my game. All of the friends that I've talked to, they don't have any of the diamond rewards either. So I guess Rockstar is just being super delayed when it comes to rolling this out. Now, after tomorrow, after the 13th, if you still have not received the diamond program rewards. Now, if the 13th does come and go tomorrow and you have not received either the thank you gifts or the diamond program rewards, again, my recommendation would just be to reach out to Rockstar support and let them know that you have not received the items. I am typically, and I don't know if it's just my account or where I live, I like never get the rewards on the first day. I'm always like one of the last ones to get it. But even this seems a bit overkill where it's like Rockstar has almost messed it up. Now again, if you're curious what these free rewards for the Diamond program was for the silver status, which you got by buying the Master Penthouse or again, getting it for free with Twitch Prime, you ended up getting the She's Loaded wall art, which actually does look pretty good in my opinion. And you also got the Diamond Classic Tee, which is a simple t-shirt design with a fun logo in the center. If you achieved gold status by unlocking the second co-op mission for the casino and resort, you would end up getting a Trufade t-shirt, which is pretty cool, white t-shirt with the Trufade logo. And you'd also be getting the exclusive ink ink livery for the Trufade Thrax, which in my opinion is one of the best looking liveries for this vehicle. So it is kind of unfortunate that Rockstar is sort of holding this one back and not allowing us to get it. And you guys can see here that I've kind of paired it with this purple paint job. The ink ink logo sort of like glows and whatnot. And it's got this fun like royal crown yellow design all over it. So I'm actually really looking forward to that when it's finally added into the game. The next level is Platinum Status, where you have to complete five casino work missions for Agatha Baker. These are the free roam work that you do. You get the Lucky Sevens tattoo, and you also get the Kronos Era watch and all the variations. Now, I don't know how many variations there are going to be, but uh, it looks like a pretty fancy timepiece. And Diamond Status, which I think is the best level you get two exclusive liveries. The first is for the Anis S80RR, which is this E. Cola livery. You get this if you participate in all six of the missions, meaning you are not the host. And this, again, in my opinion, is like the best looking livery for the Anis S80RR. It's almost like Rockstar were designing the liveries and were like, which ones are the best? Okay, let's hold these for a special program that we're going to be doling out. And unfortunately, no one's getting them quite yet. But anyways, that is the livery for the S80RR. And then if you were the host for all six of the missions, you get the Yeti camo livery for the Anus Paragon R and the armored variant too. If you unlock it for the regular one, if you happen to have the armored version as well, it's there too. So you basically are getting two for one right there. So it's really three liveries in total. 
the armored variant of the Paragon R, the normal Paragon R, and the Anus 80RR. And again, when I'm making this video, which is on Monday, August 12th, I haven't seen a single person get these items in GTA Online. So Rockstar really is on sort of the razor's edge here because by tomorrow, that is when all these items are supposed to start rolling out. So as always, I'll be sure to keep you guys updated if any new information arrives. And of course, when the second batch of the Diamond Program rewards are revealed, I'll let you guys know what the requirements are for that and also what the reward items will be. And let me know in the comments down below, what have you received so far from Rockstar? Have you gotten everything? Have you gotten nothing? Let me know your thoughts, opinions, and more in the comments down below. I'd love to hear from you guys down there. If you did go on to enjoy this video, though, a like rating would, of course, be awesome. And remember to subscribe if you guys are new or you want to stay up to date on all the latest GTA 5 casino news, info, videos, and more. And be sure to ring that notification bell as well. Sometimes YouTube just doesn't work, and if you ring that bell, you'll always be guaranteed to be notified when new videos arrive. But of course, as always, guys, thank you all so much for watching. Take care, and I'll see you guys in the next video.